Kia ora, I'm Nathan Penny. We've had some farm input inflation data out recently and that they've basically confirmed what farmers already know. That is, farm input inflation is white hot. Indeed, over the March year, inflation is up a whopping 9.9% and that's a record high for the series. Notably, that's also three percentage points higher than general or consumer price inflation, <coughs> so farmers are wearing it more than most. The, the input inflation picture is generally quite broad based, but there are, have been two key contributors over the past year. And firstly, fuel prices are up by a whopping 50% for the year, while fertilizer prices are up as a category by 37%. Although we do know that some individual fertilizers may be up by more than that. Other categories are also gathering up ahead of steam. Feed prices are up 7.5% for the year, while interest rates are also up by a similar amount. And lastly, wage inflation is picking up steam after it has been quite subdued in previous years. The picture from here is also quite gloomy on the inflation front. We expect um, farm input, um, input inflation to stay hot in the new season, if not beyond. In contrast, the general picture for inflation or for consumer price inflation is that we expect it to start moderating by the end of this year and into next. In other words, we expect farm input, um, input inflation or the slowdown of farm input, input inflation will take longer. The key reason for that is that farm incomes remain strong and that's going to translate into firm demand for farm inputs and keep the upward pressure on prices. For example, I expect uh, input prices for feed and wages to actually accelerate from here over the next year. So while fuel prices, for example, may wax and wane over the, over the coming year on global developments, the general picture of high input inflation is likely to, be, to remain the same for farmers over the, over the coming year or so. So in other words, we'll pay to keep one eye, if not two, on input costs for the, for, for the, for, for the foreseeable future. Talk to you next time. Ka kite anō.